Ooh, look at you being all fancy. Options. Subtitles. Yes. Always with the subtitles. It used to be a military base. Well, it used to be a ranching thing, then it was turned into an army thing, then it became a bird thing and a museum or whatever. Henry Fonda stationed here, I think, for a oh bit. Oh god, this is Unless immediately he was insufferable. Who's Henry Fonda? Around Christmas time, this little breakfast place used to sell these amazing polar bear sugar cookies. Man, those were good. And then one year they changed the formula or whatever Who's and Henry ruined it. Fonda. Alright. Alex? Hey! Still oh, with us? This is gonna be insufferable, isn't it? You haven't said anything for like ten minutes. Mission control to Alex. This is Big Papa. Do you read me? Uh, yeah, sorry. Yeah, um, sorry. So you all moved in? Um, not, not really. I just got in this morning. And how did her mom meet your dad exactly? <laughs> they met on vacation in Orlando. He got lost in a, you know, actually, I'm not even gonna tell this story. It's really not worth it. <laughs> yeah, please don't. Okay. Uh, yes, please don't. Let's not relive their meat cute any more than we have to. Oh god, this just is horribly insufferable. Yeah, I was, um... I'd been out of school, and the timing had just never worked out, so... And what? Does that make you to her, then? Hey, uh, second cousin? I don't know how... Uh, he's just a guy? What else would he be? No, but isn't there, like, a term for it? Um, stepbrother, technically. <laughs> oh, yeah. I forgot that was even a thing. <sighs> well, at least you seem cool, right? Cool guy, cool hat. You get a cool new sibling, living right in your house. Sharing your toothbrush. Wearing your... No, that's the weird part. I mean, isn't it, like... The concept of just getting a new sister, like a puppy, isn't it kind of awkward? <laughs> no, it's been totally bizarre. But just for the record, I don't consider you a pet. So... How do you two know each other? Oh, from way back when, like Paleozoic. Grade school era. Young enough that I've seen her in a bathtub and it wasn't sexual at all. I mean, we both looked like little skinned potato blobs. <laughs> yeah, well, you don't see a man's toddler penis and not become best friends after that. Yeah, exactly. Bond stronger than oak. Check under your seat to make sure you don't leave behind any grandchildren. Uh, so, how do you it's a recording. Know it? They always play. Oh, oh, we should get a quick picture. All of us. This will be like the before shot. Fine, just hold the camera out. Like, far. I don't look my freshest right now. It's true, Jonas. This is like B minus Alex. Just for your uh, calibration. And it's Jonas? Not Jonah? Yeah, Jonas. Like Jonas Salk? Right, patient zero, AIDS guy. It's, um, biblical, right? Or is that the lion guy? I think every name's biblical, so probably. Here's good. There, great. I'll magic erase all the warts out and stuff, so don't worry. Hey, Alex, you brought the radio, right? The little portable one? What radio? That little, you know, the little, it almost looks like a toy, the, uh, oh, oh, you're joking. Just bring it out, will you? There's the little guy. Our high school has a radio station, and Carly, she's a friend of ours. She's filling in because Reggie got mono from some track runner or something. It doesn't matter. What matters is that she's going to say something like, basically, right now, about our thing, so... Tune it to 88.3 so I can tell her we heard. Which I played because that song's been stuck in my head since I woke up this morning. But, oh, oh, actually, it's a little after 10 o'clock, which means my dear friend Ren and his buddies are probably just touching down on Edwards Island for the yearly bash on the beach or whatever we call it now. But anyways, I promised him that I'd play a song from his band, so hope you're listening, Ren. Here are the red-headed bedwetters with baby carrots. This is all horrible. <laughs> That's awesome. I hope Christina, with her talent show judge face, was listening. We must be getting close. There's no radio reception on the island. 
I'm glad I got to hear it before it went totally kaput. If we can't use it, why'd you bring it? Not just for the boat. Um, no. You'll see. I don't expect too much, but nah, it'll be fun. I won't undercook it. You'll see. Smell that clean air, boys and girls. Boy and girl. This ain't city living. Yeah, um, anybody need a smoke? I have a full pack. Uh, oh, uh, no thanks. I mean, I literally just said the clean air thing, so... Alex, you can bum one off me if you're empty. Yeah, sure. Really? Since when do you smoke? Last time you tried it, I thought you were gonna vomit on my shoes. Since now, that's when. Okay, just remember. Aim to throw up in the water. Here's the smoke if you want it. <coughs> you all right? <coughs> They're filtered. Yeah, yeah, no, I'm in <clears throat> flavor country over here. All right. My other friend should be up and around the bend. Actually, that... I mean, I don't mean to be the guy to break us up already, but... Can I have, like, two real quick minutes with Alex for a second? And you can, you know, you can run up and meet your friends? Uh, really? Just... That... Wait, is, is something wrong? What is it? Nothing's wrong, nothing's wrong. It'll just take two minutes, super fast. All right, but... <laughs> uh, look, I, I don't want to go up by myself. I mean, can't we just stick together? You're gonna have all night to say, like, whatever. But since you want to meet up with your friends anyway... We're all gonna meet up with them. It's like a buddy system. So no, it's... it's fine, Ren. Go on up ahead and we'll catch up with you. Um, okay. I guess. Though this is a really strange way to start like off interrupting splitting up. A chicken It'll be game. fast. Thanks, man. I'll just be up the hill, in case... whatever. Ren seems nice. He's funny. You know? Reminds me of a guy I know back home. Yeah, when the flag is flying, we are... funning. Um, I think it's supposed to say running. Oh. Listen, I just wanted to grab you ahead of time and say you've been cool about everything. And I guess it's just for me, I, I, I've never moved anywhere. And like, getting a new family at the same time kind of feels like I'm skipping the training halls. Not that it's been bad or anything. You and your mom have been great. Uh, we'll make do. Lemons. Lemonade. However that goes. An optimist. Oh, Christ. Oh, stop it. Oh, and thanks for setting up the attic for me. Aw, It's cool how it's like a little bedroom. I was in the basement at my old house, so this is... Yeah, no problem. Anytime. That was Mike's room, huh? Dead brother? It's nice at night, isn't it? <laughs> yeah. We can catch back up with Ren now. I didn't mean to take so long. Bye bye me. It's kind of kitschy, right? It's kind of kitschy? Yeah, it's like a quiche. Oh, shut up! Uh, I think they block this off at night since nobody needs to use it. Or maybe they just had a parade? Sure. Either one. Uh, if nobody lives here and the stores are all closed, whose car is this? Oh, there's always that one lonely car in every parking lot. God damn, this game is... This is like Josh Whedon just... But somehow more obnoxious. Ah, oh, I forgot this was even here. It's a monument to some submarine that was sunk off the coast. Oh, do the the um, the radio guide thing they talked about on the boat. You know, it's what, but like one hundred two point three. I just want to see how it works. Named 
after the Hawaiian god of the sea, the USS Kanaloa was launched on January 15, 1941, and commissioned huh. into service at the end of that year under the command of Lieutenant James Earl Clapman. On October 28, 1943, it was sunk by the Japanese sub-chaser Tokusada, some 25 miles off the coast. Parks and Facilities Office. Ren's sister Allison used to work there. You'd like her. She's tall. Um, all right. Okay. Yeah, tall women are a thing. Man, they close up early. My wife is tall. I guess no point in staying open if nobody's here. Eh, true. That's true. <laughs> Hello, kids. Look, the other guys and gals must be further up, so oh, God, be quick now. Obnoxious. Okay, speed read definition of Edwards Island. This is a tourist trap with shops You're like and a beach. Warner, Nobody lives here except for some geriatric named Mrs. Virgin. Adler. But, as God is my witness, we'll never mention her or any other old person's name again. We are here to drink and be stupid. A tradition apparently started by board recruits in the 1950s. Okay, if I get to drink, this game might have some redemption. Town. They literally called it trolling. Uh-huh. Wait, how'd they pull that? Isn't the beaten path officially ends here? The beach is past the fence. I think Jerry told me that there's a way that you used to get over there, but I'm blanking on what it was. But it's not, I mean, it can't be too difficult. So, to summarize, we are not allowed here after dark. The town is. Sh I think the dumpster will get us over if it'll budge. Well, let's try it. Anyways, the town's youths keep the whole slink over and camp thing alive and well. No, 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 I, um, I, I got it. Uh, yeah, isn't this supposed to be like a giant, swarming, animal mask-wearing freakout? Where's everybody else? Jesus, Alex, it's just supposed to be like a somewhat oversized kegger, and I think more people are coming. And the other thing is the weirdo caves. Weirdo caves? The whole reason Alex brought her radio is... Yeah, I'm out. I noticed myself trying to get away from the game now, which is not a good sign. But if these guys get to drink a little, well, that's that's a factor. Right? Oh, uh, before we get there, I should I should probably mention that. <laughs> <laughs> oh, God. Who's that? That's, so, there's this girl, Nona. Oh, God She's damn it. She's just this girl, and I'm totally into her, and I want her to be into me, so just, you know, j just be cool, okay? No pouting or complaining or anything, all right? Deal? Ren, relax. Oh, and okay, Jonas, now that we're dumpster buddies, what was the thing that you said to Alex back there? Do you have one of those vestigial tales or something? Uh, Just not... leave it alone, Ren, all right? You don't have to hear everything. I don't have to hear everything, but I want to hear everything. It's not a big deal, really. Just forget about it. Reginald, I hear you over there. Hey, guys. Talking over Wait, people at the saying, game. I was about to tell a story. What was it? About Brad's car. Oh, so well, Nona's the one. Can wait. She, oh god, these people are all awful and they're totally obnoxious. Hey, we started a fire down the way, but Nona wanted to play beach nanny, so. Uh, yeah. Everyone, this is Jonas. Jonas, everyone. Hey. Hi. And Jonas, that's. Who are you again? Jonas. Jonas. He's Alex's new in town, fresh as the daisy stepbrother. Stepbrother. Oh, so Nona's really? immediately yeah, into. It's a trip, right? Uh, yeah, this is his first night here, so everybody be on your best totally behavior. into uh, Treat him uh, as you would a scary dog. Palms out. <laughs> That's, um, I don't bite. It's fine. Wait, 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 wait. You're Jonas. Jonas, the stepbrother. Yeah. Um, what's your name again? That is Clarissa. How but are she's... you her stepbrother? Like, what does that even mean? Um... I'll give you three guesses. <laughs> Her mom's getting remarried, that's all. She's getting remarried to a guy, and that's the guy's son. So, domino effect? Yeah, well, I guess this is happening now. This is a thing that is happening, so... <sighs> Where's everyone else? Oh my god, I would shoot all and, these people. Uh, who else was supposed to come? Anyone? Everyone? Clarissa, we... <laughs> we took the last ferry. I thought more would show up, but... <laughs> oh my god, it's just Alex and her new stepbrother? Huh, that's it. That's who you brought. That's the group. Clarissa, come on. Don't be mean. This is supposed to be fun. <laughs> Who said I'm not having any fun? I'm having fun. This is like friggin' Candyland right now. Wait, aren't you all, like, friends? I'm friends with Nona, and I'm downgrading Ren to, like, a creepy neighbor. And you I just met. Huh. <laughs> 
Yeah, I'm getting the picture now. You see, yeah, Jones, is normally annoying. this is like a 20 deep rager, but Pat had a party last weekend and... And a bunch of kids got caught TPing the school. But this is great, right? We're on Edwards Island. Forget those losers who couldn't handle the weekend, who didn't think we could make it, who lost my invitation, who had to go Faster. on there. We've been hearing about this for years, and now we're going to do it. This is going to be amazing, right? Right, guys? Yeah. The music's good, at least. Are there, like, ghosts to kill these people yet, please? Fire! Man's great equalizer. So, what's the, um... What's the, like, thing to do here? Other than, obviously, go skinny dipping and get murdered by Jason Kruger. Yeah, let's just get drunk. It's supposed to be a party, right? Hey, where does that old woman live? Oh, you mean Maggie Adler? I, I yeah. like my decision. Nowhere. Get drunk. She's dead. What? Yep, killed over three days ago. It was all over the news. Local news, anyway. Oldest living resident. Her family's been moving back and forth on the ferry, getting all of her crap. Hey, we could go see her house. It must be huge. She was rich as No, a... we can't see her house. There's a giant fence, and I don't want to tear my jeans trying to climb it. And to oh, answer God your previous damn it. question, Jonas, the thing to do yes. is lay on the yes, that's and drink until you can't that's remember where you are. Let and me sometimes play truth or slap. Let yeah, me let's say drink. We can inaugurate Jonas. Ease him into the night's festivities. Isn't it a uh, truth or booze, dare? Booze, booze, this booze, booze. This is better than truth or dare because nobody ends up licking somebody's butthole. You get asked a question. You have to tell the truth. But if somebody can prove that you lied, the accuser gets to slap you. It's a good, uh, getting to know somebody game. Yeah, fun. An excuse to hit run. Hey, I'm the truthiest truth who ever All truthed, right, let's uh, just get on with it. Okay, so first we're gonna... I'll start. Ren. Uh-huh. Come on, fess up. You want to go out with Nona, right? Clarissa! Wait, wait, wait. I want to... Oh, man. You're good at this. Well, if being good means being kind of mean about it... Look, it's tough to gauge. Uh, something <laughs> like... Enough stalling. I know you want to sample the goods. Now no. just face it. I mean, I, I I like her as a friend. Do it! Right? That's... I just like her Do as a friend. Do it! That's, that's all. She's cool. She's... She's just a friend. Oh, all yeah. All right. Great, let's just move on. Yeah, that's awkward. Okay, it's Rush the buzz, man. Right. He gets to ask somebody something. Alex, Alex, Alex! <laughs> Uh-oh. I just have to think about which nerve I want to so delicately pinch. Oh, please. Shoot, I can take it. Booze. Okay. Mary, screw, kill. Me, Nona, and Clarissa. What? Oh, absolutely, <laughs> Nona. It's fun. It's funny, I don't know. And Jonas uh, is family now, technically. No, so he's fun. excluded. Well, I'd marry Nona. I like the quiet types. I'm flattered, I think. <laughs> okay, you're going down uh... the line. Who do you do the dirty with? Clarissa, obviously. <laughs> obviously. You're not going to call her out on that? No, I yeah, believe her. I mean, look at me. And wait, wait, that means you'd kill me? Out of everyone here, your best friend. Hey, you wanted to know. And I'm the only guy. This is... Is Miss Andrew. Miss Andrew. Okay, that's okay, it. We're done. Down. Game's over.